Hey guys, welcome back, welcome back to our channel. If you are new to this channel, subscribe to our channel. Well, now in this video, I am going to share you how to transfer files from PC to PC or from your phone to PC using the nearby sharing method. And for this, you no need to use any USB cables and no need of both device should be in the same Wi-Fi network. Only with the help of Bluetooth itself, you can easily transfer files and also you can just share that any copied text in from Android phone to the laptop easily using this method. So for this, there is a two different methods. One is that if you are using a Windows PC means so by default, there is a nearby sharing option. So here is a nearby sharing. So you can just access this settings in the Windows 11 by just to go to the settings option and here click on the system and here is the option nearby sharing once you go to this option you have to select this everyone nearby once you've done that and after that just to go to the file manager now select the file as per your wish and just a right click and there you can click on the share option now here you can able to see the nearby share so if you have another pc in within a 10 meter location means so you can able to share these files to that pc by using the nearby share method so in that PC also you need to enable the nearby share settings. So in that PC also go to the settings and they, and they enable the everyone nearby so that you can able to see that PC in this section. By this method you can share the files from one PC to another PC using the default windows nearby sharing method. And now the next method is that Google's nearby sharing method. For that you need to install a small tool in your windows pc whether it's a windows 10 or windows 11 so i have given the link in the description so you can click that or else in the google search search for nearby share for windows and you'll get the link so in that link just click on the get started and install that uh, exe file and as usual install the nearby share for google tool so once you installed now in your windows pc search for nearby share so here is the application nearby share from google click on that so once you installed the tool and now after that the basic step is that you need to enable the bluetooth and wi-fi in both pc and in which phone you want to share the files you need to enable the both wi-fi and the bluetooth now the next step is that you need to enable the nearby sharing in both the PC and the mobile. In the Windows PC, in this tool, you have to just select this drop down menu. Now click on the receive from everyone, this option. You need to select this option. And as well in Android phone, once go to the notification bar. So here under the quick settings, you can able to enable the nearby share uh, this option. And if you want to go to the settings means you can just go to the Android settings and there click on Google and here click on device and sharing and here is the option nearby share just to click on that. Now here also you need to enable the device visibility. So by default this has been disabled enable this option and after that just to click on this device visibility. Now here also you will see the three option just to click on the everyone and here by default use everyone more temporarily has been selected so keep this option itself because it's actually very safe so once you selected this option if you not use the nearby share for uh, uh, some minutes so after that it will be automatically turned off so because of that it's very safe and secure so now once you enabled the visibility for everyone in both the device now you need to transfer the files so just to select any file whatever you want so now I am going to share this file from Android phone to PC and you can also transfer the files without the uh, internet data also. So here is the option without internet once you select it so you can use the option without internet. So by turning off the mobile data also so without the internet data also you can able to transfer and also in the Wi-Fi settings it's currently connected I am going to disconnect the Wi-Fi network as well. So without the internet data also you can able to transfer the files because the transfer is happening using the Bluetooth and in case if you want a fast transfer means enable the Wi-Fi connection also in both uh, uh, device. So now just to select the file which file you want to transfer and after that click on the share. Now you can see the nearby share option click on that. So now here you can able to see your laptop or PC. So just to click on that and your device name is also so here available in your pc so i can able to find my device name just to click on that so 
so now in the pc you need to click on the accept option so once you click on the accept now the file has been transferred so it takes some time because we are not using the any internet data so now the file has been transferred and once the file has been received you can open it from here and also you can change the receive location for that click on the settings here and here is the option save received files to you can change the location wherever you want and here is the device visibility if you want to keep the everyone mode all the time means you can select this option and also you can change the device name here itself and you can also directly open the file right from here itself so now we have actually transferred this photo from android phone to windows laptop and one more thing is that in your android phone you have copied some text and you want to transfer the text from android phone to your pc or laptop means your windows pc or laptop means you can able to do that for that also you can if for example i am now copying this text so once copied whatever text click on the after copied you see the option share i am using the google chrome browser click on the share now you can able to see the same nearby share option just to click on that now you can again see the same device once click on the device just to click on the accept so now the text received once click on the copy so now just to open any uh, sticky notes and here once click on the paste so that same text uh, what we copied on the android phone so that we can able to paste in the windows pc and you can only able to transfer the copied text from android phone to pc and you can't able to transfer the copied text from pc to uh, android phone so i didn't find any option for that and if you know means uh, let me know that in the comment section below and similarly using this uh, nearby sharing method you can transfer files from android phone to android phone and android phone to uh, any pc windows pc or laptop and also you can transfer files from windows pc to another windows pc for that in the another pc also you need to install the nearby share from google application well now that's it on this video guys using this method you can easily transfer files from your own devices easily using the nearby sharing method and if you have any questions let me know that in the comment section below and if you like this video hit the like button and thanks for watching this video guys Thank you.